Hello YouTube, and welcome to yet another edition of The Mock Show. Yeah, it's been a while. Um, for those of you wondering about the new mask, well, I can't find my regular one, so I'm just wearing part of my Halloween costume. Yes, this is, this one's also handmade. Um, right. Well, I did re-engineer him a bit. I changed his arms. He no longer holds the uh, Maraca of Death instead of just pegs onto the back of his arm. His arms are a bit longer and that means they're a bit spindlier as well, but they are even more, ooh, not good, more pokeable than they used to be. Um, anyways, just a second. Here's his new right leg. Um, I decided to keep with the non-humanoid uh, component, um, and frankly, the wasp thing just looked awful in well, really both modes. Well, actually, all three modes. And just a second, my computer is being weird. Uh, sorry about that. And let me just pop this off real quick. Oh, well, I'll show you the... And it actually has proper articulation. Unlike the last one, which could not even bend at the knee or stay properly. Um, it can also go a little bit from... Sort of from side to side, more of the heel. But uh, you just have to adjust the heel and then the toe bits individually. But it still works. Anyways, let's pop that off so I can show you. Now, personally, I've always been a fan of spiders and motorcycles, and I combine them into one. Now, second. Oh god, he's going to be. Alright, I'll just show off spider mode first. Unfortunately, he is a four-legged spider, so I'm a biology major, and uh, I just say deal with it. Anyways, get the bits all over the bottom. You'll have to excuse me, it's been too two, three weeks since I've traced one this guy. Um, finals were a couple weeks ago, so that's half the reason I hadn't updated in a while. And the other half is, well, it's the holiday season. And I finally freaking graduated, so yeah. I honestly hold school more important than getting videos of my stuff posted on YouTube. And, and brother. Right then. Thank you. Okay. No, that's not. Sorry, just give me a second. A long couple of weeks. And as you can't see my eyes. Yes, it is kind of difficult to see what I'm doing through these. If the holes are actually smaller than on the other mask. Anyways, yeah, four legged spider. Oh, and that keeps happening. Yeah, these are Roxy, uh, back and necks, um, whatever. Anyways, hopefully you all can even hear me. Uh, posability, head, uh, independent from cephalothorax, which isn't entirely accurate, um, but yeah, anyways, uh, all the legs are full jointed, and they all have the same rotation and, uh, posability, I guess this could be some sort of bizarre attack, I don't know, um, yeah, anyways, I may or may not attach 
four more legs, but honestly, it just depends. Right now, I'm looking for a job, and that is more important than this. So, yeah. Uh, so, hopefully, I'll get to update more than what I normally do. Um, for the other mode, moving on. As you saw, that it does have two gigantic wheels. So, those of you who know me know that I'm a sucker for motorcycle. It is motorcycle transformers, and yes, that's what this one does. Uh, not quite transilus, but uh, well, transmetals too. Transmetals transilus from Beast Wars. If you're old enough to know what the hell I'm talking about. Um, right. This bit here will get down, but for now, I'll just have to pop there. And no, it does not have a robot mode yet. And that uh, yet is a definite possibility that I'll work on one. Because uh, I kind of like it, but honestly, it needs. Uh, oh, right. Uh, some more work to the beast mode design. Now the wheels do roll like this, but uh, it's kind of hard to get it to balance. So I probably will have to add those four more legs, and if I wanted a decent robot mode, I definitely have to do that. Um, uh, and I probably need new socket joints for this to help with the wheels spinning. Because um, sometimes they do catch, and it's kind of annoying. Yeah, you guys can't see that character well right now. The wheels do spin. You just have to hold the bits that they're attached to, unfortunately, which makes it kind of a pain. Um, so yeah, it needs some further engineering, but the wheels do spin in both modes. Well, not both modes, but in this mode. Um, personally, I like the fact that the things become handlebars for the bike. Um, I just need a light or something right here. Because, uh, otherwise this thing can't drive at night legally. Um, anyways. Right. Um, like I said, looking for a job, so this is going to be a, well, it was going to be a short episode, but it seems that I've gone in eight minutes. When this is, should have probably only taken five. Oh, the last two tents only took five. Anyways, uh, this is Gyro Coffee and saying, good luck, good building, and goodbye. Have fun. Oh, and about this, yeah. The rest of the costume was actually a suit jacket, and there's a golden bit that goes into the back of my head, um, but that gets really, really warm to wear, so yeah, screw that. Have fun.